So after just eight months in business, a local sushi caterer is on a roll. Dun -dun -dun Boom, thank you. I didn't write that, so I can't take credit for it. <laughs> the startup is bringing in big clients here in town and helping children halfway around the world. Our Angela Cunningham shows us how a new sushi is making meals with a mission. <laughs> we always have fun in here. In a small commercial kitchen near 52nd and Eastern, this team of chefs crank out about 2,000 boxes of sushi each week. Every morning, we know that this is not just making sushi. 25-year-old Anu Soon says her company offers great sushi and a great cause all rolled up into one. When we start this business, we want to have the purpose. A new sushi named after its owner is delivering on the promise of a purpose. The catering company got its start inside the downtown market incubator kitchen and after just seven months it became the fastest growing startup to graduate from there. I'm proud of myself and I'm happy because it's just not me who benefit from this business. With each tray the caterer sells, one meal is donated to an orphanage in Myanmar formerly known as Burma. Ever since I'm little, one of my goal is uh, to help the orphanage when I grow up. In less than one year, Anu, who was orphaned herself at the age of five, has been able to donate more than 50,000 meals to the children and take a huge burden off the orphanage. And with all other sources that they have, they start to build their own um, like houses and more uh, place for the kids. So. Right now, a news clients are local companies, schools, and hospitals, Hope College and Spectrum Health, to name a few. I love it. But she hopes her success will one day soon allow her to open her own restaurant as well. Yeah, a lot of goals <laughs> try to reach every day step by step. In Kentwood, Angela Cunningham. 13 on your side.